So it looks like you've successfully created an account at Kali.org but don't have access to the lessons. The reason you don't have access to lessons is likely because we don't know what school you go to. And we don't know that because you haven't added your school's unique Kali authorization code to your user account profile. So in this video, I'm going to tell you how to edit your account profile to add your school's authorization code so you can start using Kali lessons. Without an authorization code included in your profile, your account will continue to be a guest account without access to Kali lessons. So first you'll need to find out what that code actually is. Go to www.cali.org slash contacts. This will list your school's authorization code contact, email or call to ask your school's contact for the Kali authorization code. In the unlikely event that your school isn't listed in the contacts page, your school is not a Cali member school, so contact us for further details. So once you've got that authorization code from your school's rep, you can go to www.cali.org and log in with the account you've already created. Keep that authorization code handy though. So click on my profile under your name. Click edit. Scroll down to about the middle of the page where it says authorization code with the word guest in it. Delete the word guest and type in that authorization code you just got from your rep. Click outside the box so that a list of graduation dates pops up. Now if you don't see that list of graduation dates, you've entered the wrong code. So select the year that you plan to graduate and then scroll to the bottom and push save. You're now ready to start running Cali lessons, which you'll be able to do by logging in, finding a lesson, and then pushing the run this lesson link. Now if you're still having problems, you can shoot me an email at agrootheuis at cali.org. Thanks.